are not thinking in those terms. It's not that they're thinking, oh, I don't deserve anything and I'm worthless. It's like, no, I'm just not thinking in those terms. I'm thinking, what's oh, the work okay, that needs to be done? What's yeah, the work yeah, that yeah. needs to be done? And can I do that? And how can I make it work? <laughs> and like being and being able to trust that, okay, in this co-op, my needs are going to be taken care of. And I know that this can happen. I've experienced it. And it was freaking mind-blowing and kind of life-changing at the Ghana's Intentional Community. Um I was there, you know, visiting Michael and uh, he, they had hired me to, you know, I was out doing for a geo meeting and I'll oh, stick around for a couple of weeks and paint, you know, a couple of our yeah. buildings. And um, so I, you know, said, oh yeah, it'd be great. You know, stay on the Island, Staten Island for a while and hang out with the community. Um, unfortunately, <laughs> uh, when, you know, the time that I got there, the guest room that they had available was kind of a little bit distant from the rest of the community. It was above one of their shops, like down on the commercial strip and a little bit noisy and, you know, and, uh, yeah. it, 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 you know, I was a little bit disappointed, frankly, like when I'm like, oh, okay, this is my room. I mean, okay, all right, fine. You know, but having right. the attitude yeah. that I do, it's like, eh, you know, it's fine. I'll take one for the team. And, and uh, you know, it's like, and if they have a better room, like I'm only going to be here for two weeks. So it's like, if they had a better room, they probably have like a, a full-time resident that should go in there or something, right? Um, yeah. Well, I'm there for, I'm working for a couple of days. And uh, and Michael, you know, at dinner was, he's like, so how do you like your room? Is it all right with you? A little bit. And I'm like, oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's like, you sure? It's not like maybe a little too far from the community, you like something a little closer, you know, I'm like, he's well, great. I mean, if you're, yeah, I mean, if you're asking, he's like, yeah, I mean, some of us were talking about it and we thought, you know, maybe you'd like to be closer and, you know, there's this room up here and it was, yeah, I like, I almost cried like yeah. right yeah. there. Cause it's like, I've, I don't think I've ever been in a situation where other people were thinking about what I might need. Yeah. And I didn't. So I, it's like, I don't have to think about that. Yeah. I could just think about how can I serve the community and do what needs to be done. And I've got 80 other people making sure I'm going to get the, what I need. Right. And that is like the mindset right. that I think we really need to try to be coming from. Yeah. And, you yeah. know, I tried yeah. in my economics, yeah. <laughs> you know, when I was a, yeah. an economics student to get my, one of my classes to do a, you know, just accept that like, okay, let's do a thought experiment where um, instead of everybody's like, you know, like everybody's spending their own income on themselves to fill their needs, like how we do it, like that in you, nobody would, you weren't allowed to spend any money on yourself. Like everybody gets their paycheck, but you're only allowed to spend money for other people. Like how right. would that change things? Oh, that's and, great. Yeah. And wouldn't that be better? Right. Like yeah. all of a sudden yeah. I would have all these people who can like spend money on, <laughs> right. And, and, uh, um, That's a totally great one.